what's happening guys i'm out with rick of the blue jay i got an invite to go fishing with him and john skinner and we're gonna go to some of my spots where i've been pulling up some nice fish and the goal is to get john and rick on some really big tog we get on those big fish and in the deep water the bite is very different than the inshore shallow i'm gonna do really well it all comes down to bait presentation having the right rig and knowing that deep water bite when to swing please subscribe if you enjoy these videos Can you say we use the rex whole, are usually uh, loaded with them the whole uh crap? yeah take the claws off leave the legs on you can snip the back legs and then clip the horns oh yeah it's still moving you, you don't uh, smash the shell N you can but i don't I'm not even gonna get to the bottom with six ounces here oh really no yeah i'm holding with 12. this is good it's just gonna get better I, yeah I you can probably even get away with 10. yeah you can get away with 10. All right. It feels All right. soft though. I don't feel the structure. Oh, I got hit already. So one big thing I talk about on this trip is once you're hitting this deep water and those juices and guts are out of that crab, you could see it's hollowed. I get rid of it. I discard it because after the first minute, you're going to notice that bite changing and you'll have to send down a fresh crab to get that bite again. Big guys are lazy this morning. They're just getting up. Okay. Okay. This is decent. Oh yeah. This is this is a keeper. Not huge, it's a keeper though. Ooh, ooh. A keeper? Yeah, maybe, maybe not, maybe. Close. It's close. It's thick. Well, that could be. Yeah, I think that keeps. Oh, measure it. Give her a measure. Hey, knock it off. Okay. I didn't even feel that bite. Wow. It was like a little tap tap and I just lifted and he was there. I think it's sea bass though, because I'm not getting, it's not tugging down. Yeah, there, he's gonna turn on when he sees the boat. Feels like a sea bass. Okay, now he's tugging. He saw the boat. Okay. Betterer. Oh, that's better. Yep, betterer. There we go. Yeah. They're gonna get bigger. The big guys are gonna come out, I promise. Hit right away as soon as I go down. Ooh, ooh, I should, no he's not. With bigger fish in the deep, once you lift like that, they won't come back for it. Under 10 pound fish will, but not the big DDs. They're smarter than that. Oh, come on, I'm getting slammed. Okay. Oh yeah, this is a good one. This is a good one. Oh God. John, what the hell? Oh, it's a good fish. <laughs> the white crab is what they want. It makes them commit too, and you don't crush. They can't pull off the hook so easy. Need a nine, you know. Nah, I pulled up the nine. He was so tired. Went, whoa. whoa. I pulled him right in the boat, my leader. This thing's tiring me out, man. Well, when you got a 200 pound test leader. 
<laughs> That's a good fish. Oh yeah. Wow. He's not huge, it's a nice fish. Definitely a nice fish. It's, it's with the current though, you know. White chin. Yeah, nice white chin. That's what always coming up, big male. So there's a bigger female around when you get bigger males. Okay, he's good. <laughs> good, just getting bigger. That's a keeper. There, I threw back like a dozen of these the other day. Oh yeah. my god. We were limited. We were just having fun, me and Katie. Rick, I'll, I'll rotate out with you, man. What's that? I'll rotate out with you. He won't catch him if he sits where you are. Don't, don't, you know. Don't give up my spot. Yeah, don't no. do that. <laughs> what, what is that? What are you guys talking about? <laughs> Sacrificing his good spot over there. Oh, you mean for yeah, uh, yeah for you? Somebody yeah, that knows his, yeah. what the hell's going on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, that was in structure, I think. So that's the first drop of the white crab. As soon as you hit the bottom. Hit. And I got hit. Yeah. Yeah. I was just sitting there, kind of waiting on the game. I think I'm in the structure. Yeah. Okay, there we go. You get your white crabs at Weibo? Yes, sir. Do you wrap your loop on that hook and cinch it down? Is that how you do it? And well, I had to put a dropper loop, and then I put the Ooh. the hook on the dropper loop. Loop. I, I got him. Okay, this is good. It's freaking heavy. It's not fighting yet, though. Did I foul hook it? It's gotta be foul hooked. I'll do it for you. So yeah, you just back the hook off, just so it can slide up and down, and then you put a second hook on, and twist over, and All then right, cinch I'll it down. down and then I'll, I'll I literally got like three little taps, whatever this is. I'm thinking it's a sea bass. It hasn't started fighting yet. If it sees the boat and runs, and it's a tog. That's a tog. I face hooked him. That's why it felt funny. Oh, that sucks. I got him in the eye. I feel bad. Both went in the eye. He swam right into it. Rick, you got a D hooker. I got it. I got him. Oh, he might even been a keeper, but we're gonna get bigger. At the I back leg. Oh yeah, dude. They, they, the whole bucket died by like 12 o'clock for the most part yesterday because the heat. They, they cannot take the heat. It's like calcius. <laughs> An important thing I do is always pay attention to my down scan. I'm going to see something here. Mark, what the hell is that? Mark something. Two big things. It's marking a good fish down there, though. I can oh, see that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it looks like the sealed for sure. Oh, maybe that's what it is, yeah. But you have a, no, you have a good fish, though, in the middle down there. Uh-huh. John's going to hook into this good fish. I saw a really big mark. Yeah, there's a seal on the screen. Yeah, right. But he's really high up. I mean, not that... Wait, John's got something. John, you got something good? Oh yeah. A little better? I think we'll stay here. That looks real better. Yeah, I know. That would not be cool. And you know what? I think it did. It did. No way. Yeah. It's either a hell of a it's, I think I think just turn into a mammal. Oh my god. Just look at that go. Yeah, that's a seal. That's annoying because he had a good fish. That really gets me annoyed. <sighs> that's a damn seal. Holy shit. He had a good fish too. Yeah. What do I do? I don't know. If you stop it, maybe it'll break like, oh. by the fish. I mean, what's going to happen is I, sp I cupped my reel and it pops. That's, I mean, all you can really do. Let's see if he wants to let go, but not. No, they, uh, you had a nice fish, dude. Ooh, that looks good. Not so good.
net now. No, no net. Keeper, nice keeper. Oh. That keeps. Oh yeah, that keeps. I think it's right there. There you go, Rick. There you go. Yeah. What do you think? Decent? Is, this, is the bottom bouncing or what? That's <laughs> uh, the small. Yeah. I'm not getting any bites in this jig. I think my bait's too small. It's not enticing enough. Oh, that's a keeper. Yeah, no, that's thick. Yeah, that keeps, dude. That definitely keeps. I don't know. I'd say 16 and 8, 16 and a quarter. Because that's what the 2 by 4s on center look like for sheetrock. <laughs> Yeah, how you like that, huh? How about that for jewelry? Nice fish. Nice fish. Everybody's on the board. Is that Johnny's monster? No, that's just us. They're gonna get bigger. Being digested by yeah, yes. that was a good fish, man. Yes. Definitely gonna keep. This might be a releaser. What do you mean releaser? It, yeah, no, big ones. I'm not gonna keep a huge fish. It's a good fish, man. It's a good fish. It's got weight. Uh, I would, yeah. 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 Took drag on the strike. It's heavy. I think it's gonna freak out when it sees the boat. There he comes. Oh, he's good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Beauty. Look at that fish. Ooh, ooh, very good. You're not marking a spot, are you, Rick? <laughs> no, I would never do that. Hold on, I gotta go mark the spot. I, hope, I wanna see John get on one of these big dogs. Holy moly. Look at this big mama jamba. I might have been the guy I caught yesterday and released. Holy. This was the big fish of the trip. I'm gonna estimate roughly around seven pounds based upon its size and length. Um, we did end up keeping it. It wasn't that big. You know, anything around eight pounds and up, I release. I don't like to keep the bigger fish. Uh, you know, they're breeders, and it's important to keep the fishery healthy. Also, as you can see, it does have the rectal prolapse, and it's pretty red. So once I start to see blood like that coming out from that area, I usually will not release the fish. It's just probably not going to make it anyways. So... I'm oh, he's not even that big. This ain't the one from yesterday. How, how, how many inches is it? He's uh, he's almost 22. We'll keep it, right? Wait, sure, if you want, absolutely, definitely. I have no problem keeping <laughs> them if you want to keep them. Um, if we get like a huge one, we can always. Oh God, he's gonna get the fish, man. Oh, that was a good hit. Oh, that was another good hit. That's a big hits down there, man. They're hungry. Got him. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Another good one. Another good one. Doesn't want to come up. I don't think it's as big as the last, but it's definitely a good fish. <sighs> I 
oh yeah. Good fish. Another nice one. Oh yeah, there's no question of that. Just a big female. Something good, John? Oh yeah. Oh! oh. And he broke it. That's what sucks. Yeah, that was a big fish. Son of a... You got a big one on? Yeah. 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 And, uh, and he broke the freaking line. Wow. The leader? Oh, no. Right to the braid. Wow. And, um, yeah, 30 pound. Yeah, and uh, that was the uh, first time I put the double hook on. <laughs> oh, did I get him? No, he took drag on the bite, dude. Oh, God, I hope he comes back. I don't think he will, though. Yeah, he's not going. This uh, <laughs> Todd could never be accused of using the Rick set. No, he's, I told him he's got the best hook set. Yeah. Thank you, I appreciate that. It does. A violent hook set. <laughs> I've broken two St. Croix with it though. Oh my god. The, the thing I find is it's tough to like know when to swing on some of these bigger fish because like it'll feel like a, like a small fish, but he's just mouthed it and, it and he's not like ripping at it. Ooh. Oh, damn it. So I, I missed a few really nice ones yesterday, I know that. That's how he uses notification. Is it? No, that's it. It's all my notifications. Here. Oh, you got him. Oh. Is he decent? Ah. Uh, big, that's a sea bass. Ooh. Okay, this is this is a real fish, man. Oh, it's a good one. A good fish. It slammed me. Is he lightening up? He was fighting hard. He's lightening up. Man, it gave a fight right off the bat. Oh. I think it keeps close. Check it. Yeah, looks like it's got the length by about a half inch. Oh yeah. Yeah, 16 and a half. Nice. So that's eight. Ah, uh, something like that, right? Eight fish, right? Cheap nine? Yep. Oh, I just fell in a huge hole. And like I hit as soon as I got down in there. I got it. Got him? Yep. Yeah. yeah. It's good. It's got some weight, man. It's not taking drag or anything. I wonder if I foul hooked it. Yeah, I fell in a big hole over there. That's usually where a big one's hanging out. It's not taking drag. I think it's a keeper. Yeah, it's a keeper. Another keeper. Anyways. Slimy, right? Yeah, it's like I gotta try to dig in the gills, that's all you could really do. That's a nice one. Take as 
might have come. <laughs> He's like, he wasn't having any part of it. Yeah, no. Nope. He's right. That might be close to a keeper, you yeah, think? It's, it's Borderline? Yeah. But I tell you what, man, that rod's got a lot of power. It's, uh, I'll tell you, on the Goliath group. Uh, I can't believe you guys are pulling Goliath well, up with it. Well, no, these were, these were topped out probably 40 pounds. 40 pounds, yeah, I have to say, yeah. Six years ago, when I couldn't sleep at night, I would watch John's videos until I passed out. And it's definitely paid off. Thanks, John. Thank <laughs> you.